My boy Mike. Good to see you. It's Illuminati shit. Once you start seeing it, you can't stop seeing it. Come, 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 Mr. Sunlight. How's it going? Fucking pigs hang around my crib every day and shit. I don't even know what the fuck they looking for, but those motherfuckers better watch that shit. I have to go out there and light those motherfuckers up like a fuck. Hey, sorry I'm late. Oh, we were just talking about you. Well, don't worry. Another few hours, you never have to talk about me again, Trevor. You're the one who likes to talk. Watch your back. You too. That's all I'm saying. Fuck you. Fuck you! All right, excuse all right, all me! Right, enough! Huh? Enough! Thank you. <clears throat> okay, uh, this is it. <laughs> well, we have two options. They're both a little, uh, <laughs> out there. But then again, what do you expect? Okay, option one. We hijack their armored cars. We take the crews hostage, and then we infiltrate the depository. Now, once you're in there and you've got the score, we send in a team of modded cars. You load up, you get out. And we'll need to infiltrate the transportation grid and manipulate it to aid our escape. But option two, we cause a distraction out front. Make them think we're dumb. <laughs> well, we've never had a problem convincing people of that, have we? <laughs> the other guys will be drilling, taking what they can, you're gonna be the distraction. Always the attention seeker. You know, for a guy who's always stepping on his friends to get ahead, he has an unfortunately low sense of self-worth. Okay, okay, let me show you the board. To uh, recap, these are our options. We try to make them give us the gold, or we drill a big old hole in the side of the bank and we take it out. If you're drilling a big old hole, you'll need a big old drill, a tunnel bore machine. I'll locate it, but you have to steal it and store it near the bank. They're excavating a new part of the metro network around there, so that's where you'll go in. Uh, we'll need choppers for the getaway, too. Uh, Trevor has one we can use, the other can be bought. The guys on the ground will need a getaway car, so get something fast and tough, and then modify it as much as you can to increase your chances of getting away from the cops. It's gotta be stored in a parking garage near the UD. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of heat, so think about that. Um, purr, I'm forgetting something. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> we'll need a train to land the gold on and take it to the warehouse. You'll have to steal it. Uh, again... I'll send you the details. Now, if you're interested in the more, um, subtle approach, hijacking the armored cars and so on, huh? You've got to get some police stingers. Only cops are licensed to have them, so that's a headache of its own. Oh, uh, what else? Um, oh, right, uh, you'll need to get a hold of and mod some getaway cars. Uh, normal suspension's gonna give out under a couple of tons of gold. Whoa, man, a couple of tons? Four tons in total. <laughs> That's what I can get the system to divert into the cage we're hitting. Fuck me! Okay, okay, last thing. You remember that underpass we saw from the helicopter? Well, that's where I'll set up the uh, smoke and mirrors to get the cops off your scent. I've heard that before. Michael, subtle or obvious, what's it going to be? Ha <laughs> The first driver will pilot one of the choppers getting you out of there. Half the gold will... Hey, I used them at the jewelry store, I used them at the bureau. I'll use them here. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Gunman 1 is with Franklin, burrowing... Well, he's had my back on every job since I got up and running again. He deserves a shot at the big one. Yeah, think about my buddy's chef, okay? Consummate professional. We'll only get one shot at this thing. Is this the shot we want to take? Great. All right. We get the tunnel bore machine, and we're good to go. Fucking glory seeker. Oh, you got any better ideas? Obviously not, otherwise you already killed me and done the gig yourself. I mean, what kind of vain asshole decides that the best way to rob the largest holding bank on the West Coast is for him, and him personally, to come at the front door? The kind of vain asshole who's stuck working with you, you douchebag. Okay, all right, all right, ladies. We gotta move. Come on. Man, can we fucking do this? I'll show you what you need.
Julio, my man. Bring that ass over here, please. I'd ask for your number, but they took my phone. I didn't mean nothing. You see? That's how that shit is done. It's just an online persona. It was satire or parody or something. I didn't mean it. Jim? You're taking me up Phantom Canyon in this charcoal color land stalker to punish me for trolling you? If only someone would save me. Stall him, kid. I'll be there soon. You know, you, you really are funny and interesting guys. I mean, any attention is uh, good attention, right? of anyone behind us. And if there was, you would just be there to warn you. Shut up, troll. You gave up your right to free speech when you insulted a celebrity on the internet. It was a couple of comments, some colorful language. Uh, it was harassment. You're the comedy writer. Deal with the heckle. I blocked you. You started another account. I blocked you again. You started another. But what you didn't count on is me having the money and the resources to trace your IP. I count on you having better things to do. Well, I don't. I'm a lonely man, and social media is my life. It's given me the recognition I've been denied my whole life. I can make snarky comments and glib pronouncements and lap up the adulation, banishing any form of dissent. I'm a king, and bleeder is my so kingdom. Gonna drive okay. into me. Um, that's pretty sad. Don't lose sleep over it. When I'm done, the me. <laughs> Get out the fucking way. Ah, back of that car. That's my boy's fat head. Who is that animal? That's my dad, you a-hole. Oh, he's gonna fuck you up properly. Oh, really? How big does this hurt, huh? The side... Dad! Dad! You got my son in there! Let me take you home. Thank you, shit, fuck, man, you, you, think, you think it's over? Yeah, 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 he's gone. Are you sure? Because the dude holds like a grudge, and I'm like his nemesis. I wouldn't go that far. Look, he thought you were a fat little nobody. Now he thinks you're a fat little nobody with a badass for a dad. He'll stay away. But... but I'm like his troll, Pop. I'm kind of 
kind of shaken up, Dad. Could you drive like a sane person? Call me an idiot, but a troll? Jim? What's a troll? Like a joker on the internet. What sort of jokes? Sort of mean jokes. Like what? Like someone posts something and you're all like, that sucks, you suck, dick. Oh, so jokes that aren't funny. No, you don't get it. The humor comes with repetition. Like, you say it once, big deal. Then you say it again, and again, and again, and again. Okay. Like the other day, he posts this picture of his newborn, and I'm all like, damn, son, that right there is one ugly-ass motherfucker of a baby. And I'm all like, my balls is prettier than that baby. And then I send him a picture of my balls. I seen roadkill prettier than that baby. What the hell is wrong with your baby? And he's all like, actually, there's a problem with its chromosomes or something, and it's actually a miracle it survived Earth. And I'm all like, it's actually a miracle I survived seeing a picture of its ugly? Enough! All right? E fucking enough! I get it. Maybe that one was a little OTT, but it's generally really good times. Yeah, good times. Great times. The fuck? What's wrong with you? Fucking fun you had. Driving is making me wish I was still kidnapped. The troll is back in his lair. Now stay off the internet for a while, and don't wind people up so much. I learned my lesson, Dad. I did. Yeah, sure. And I'm a tax account. I mean, I can't wait to go home and exfoliate. 